Okay, yeah. nobody gives a fuck about this shit. <laughs> I'm curious. Let's talk about. Let's, I'm curious about let's, let's, about let's talk it. about unfiltered. You parting ways with them. What happened? Who's in the right? Who's in the wrong? Um, what happened was one day I came home. Heath and Zane said we need to talk to you about something, and they said we're really proud of you. We've loved having you on unfiltered. And we're really happy that you're starting your own podcast. We just feel like it's best now that we go our separate ways. They said you're stepping on our toes. I guess so. I guess <laughs> so. It was tough, but I like I have to respect their decision. One thing though that I just want to clear up is I think right now there's a lot of people because I've read like on comments and stuff like, oh, why is Matt not on unfiltered? And a lot of people seem to think that I like left you wanted them to go on solo. my own will yeah. to do this. Mm -hmm. The thing is, I thought we I could do both. Like, because a lot of comedians have like, oh, a group podcast together yeah. and they go off and have their own individual ones. The thing is, they also wanted to expand and have guests on similar to what I'm doing. But that's it. But I but I say that with like love. I respect their decision. I still avidly support and watch Unfiltered. Mm -hmm. um, but it was after your episode, actually, that this happened. Yeah. So maybe well, you're the root cause of this, Jeff. You got to <laughs> Maybe fix this it. will start some more stuff. Hopefully. I but love, I, I but love the thing the is, I don't want beef. I don't want speculation. Like, that's just the truth. Is that it was their decision, not mine? But it's with no hard feelings, and yeah, I say that plenty, like so delicately. plenty to go around. Yeah, there's pl plenty of listeners to go around. Yeah. And what do you think of the new kid that they got that replaced you, Matt's replacement? I don't Kenny. Know. Yeah, he's a good guy. He's very talented, and I think he's a very good asset. Who do you think would win in a debate between you two? Me and Kenny. I haven't honestly spent that much time with Kenny. I don't know. That's a really good question. Does he have I speech mean, and debate experience? I, I honestly don't know much about Kenny. So.